Let's take a moment to talk about Occam Research Ratings and our overvalued, fairly valued, and undervalued ratings categories as they relate to different companies. I'm going to start here by typing in Walmart, which demonstrates the very interesting ratings history chart. As you can see here, we have positive, neutral, and negative ratings, and those really fall into the categories of undervalued, fairly valued, and overvalued. We also have an area that says we don't have an opinion at all. But in the case of Walmart, you see that we have this green bar almost the entire time since 2007. That demonstrates that we feel that Walmart has been undervalued and continues to be undervalued for a very long period of time. Now this is something of a rare price chart. And the reason why it's rare is that oftentimes Occam has overvalued and fairly valued ratings mixed in. Let's take a look at Piedmont Natural Gas Company. This is a much more common ratings chart from the standpoint of you see overvalued areas, fairly valued areas, and undervalued areas as the stock progresses. The point of this is that Occam is looking for pockets where it is a good time to perhaps move into a security or to consider rebalancing and getting out of a security, which is in fact where we are with PNY right now as a more overvalued rating. Now, the important part to understand in this is that the typical buy and hold strategy is very difficult to, to enact. And from a research perspective, you've got to be careful about just staying with the same idea and not looking at valuations each day. Another way that you can always find more ideas, in this case inside gas utilities, is click on gas utilities in the breadcrumbs area up at the top. It will bring you directly into the scatter plot chart for that sub-industry, in this case highlighting that there are lots of stocks in gas utilities that are overvalued at this point from the Occam perspective and have performed very well in the last 13 weeks. This is yet another way that Occam tries to differentiate the information you receive so that you're always getting up-to-date ratings on where we think it good entry and exit points are. But the important thing is, we're not telling you, you just want to buy and you just want to hold. Even in the case of Walmart, there is a chance that we will upgrade or downgrade any security if the metrics demonstrate that it is warranted.